This little integrated circuit chip is an INA125. It's an instrumentation amplifier. It's got 16 pins on the package. This is what's called a dual inline package because there's two rows and they're in line. Except if you look, the legs are bent just a little bit outwards from being completely straight. You see, it comes out at just a little bit of an angle there. Because these pins are a little bit angled out from the package, it makes it difficult to fit it in to get all of the pins into the sockets in the breadboard. Put it down on this flat surface and I'm going to press the chip's legs against the flat surface to bend them all just a little bit. So now if we look they're bent in a little bit, but they're all bent the same. Now I'm going to line the chip up with this little notch here at the top and that little dot there at the top left. That's pin number one and this is the top and this is just so we can line it up with the drawings on the data sheets. So if I put it into the breadboard like that I can feel and I can check by looking at it that all of the pins are sitting into one of the little sockets in the breadboard. So now I'm going to give it a little bit of a push just to seat all of those pins into the sockets 